satisfaction of the episode, it has literally been like a week since I made a cast. Um, which sounds, sounds stupid, but I mean, for me, I've been fishing every day this past, I don't know, since the beginning of the year. I would say January, February, I would say that I've consistently made a cast pretty much every day. Uh, but adulting is a uh, part of life. Uh, there's so much going on right now with school, with work, raising a baby, taking care of a family. There's just a lot going on. But I'm having a blast with life right now. Life is great. Uh, YouTube is doing good. You guys are awesome. You guys are amazing. You guys are, like always, showing so much love on the videos and on the channel and whatnot. Enough of this happy stuff, though. I did not, I'm not going to get into that. I'm trying to make an intro to this video, um, which we're taking the boat out, going fishing on Table Rock Lake, looking for some fall giants, guys. They're biting, they're biting, they're, it's picking up, I know there for a couple weeks, it was fairly slow here on Table Rock, um, you know, they were biting a little bit on some stuff, but it was never good enough to actually put a pattern together, so I think the spinner bait bite is finally picking up. Um, Maybe a top water bite. Top water bite was kind of fading off for a little bit, uh, but I'd probably throw a top water around. I know I'd probably throw a jig around, uh, but I think I'm just gonna go out and have some fun. I'm not gonna put too much thought into it. You know, we're just got we've just got like four or five hours. So we're just gonna go out and we're gonna find some fish. We're going to keep it simple. You know, there's nothing nothing crazy going on. It's nice and calm out right now. It's literally 56 degrees. The high for today. So these fish just don't know what to do. The, the you know the water temperature is all over the place. The air temperature is all over the place. Uh, but we're getting there. You know they're starting to settle down. Like I said, I'm gonna go out, have a fun day on the water. Anyways, guys, thanks for joining me on another awesome mission. I, I, I'm really thankful for you guys, really thankful for all the support. And uh, right now, boats just dropped into the water. I'm gonna rig up a couple of rods here. Stop blathering my mouth. And get to fishing, it's nice and foggy. I can't see a dang thing on the water. I literally, I mean, visibility is like 20 feet out there. It's insanity. Every morning it's just been a stupid amount of fog. But it's all good. It's all good. It fades off fairly quickly. So, anyway, guys, time to rig up some rods. Time to go catch some bass. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Do not forget to smash that thumbs up button because that really helps me out. There's one thing to do to get back to the MS Fishing TV. Uh, community so just smash that thumbs up button that's all you gotta do that's it that's all you gotta do uh but anyways guys let's go catch some fish Little guy came up and got to ride the boat. <laughs> oh, buddy. That was cool. Little squatted bass. Came up right at the boat. Snagged that thing, didn't you, boy? It's cool. So warm. Water temperatures right now are 70 degrees, so... I mean, air temperatures are like 50. Significant difference, but... Thanks for biting, buddy. Shoop. Switched up our spooks into a little smaller one compared to that big trout one. Just to see if maybe they want a little bit more subtle of an approach.
All right, we're gonna switch up our top water approach here. Just to see, you never know. Okay, switch to Barkley Chop though. Sounding good too. Forgot my dang sunglasses in the truck. So now I'm blinded, I can't see anything. Holy, what is that second, third calf? Oh, that's a good one. That's a decent one. That's a decent one. Boat flip. Oh, that's a good one. Okay. All right, so switch to the chopper and look at that big old freaking son of a gun. Dude, look at that thing. Oh. <laughs> Woo! Let's freaking go, boys. Snapped a picture. I mean, let's go, boys. That's a good fish right there, y'all. That's a solid fish. Dude, I mean, just a... Such a nice large mouth right there, guys. Beautiful fish. Gorgeous fish. I would... So I switched to that Chapo, and I like think like two or three casts later, Solid, solid, solid fish, guys. Just a solid fish. Let's go ahead and get her back in the water. Do her thing up shallow. Thanks for biting. You just made my whole day. <laughs> Shoop. There she goes. Let's freaking go, y'all. Let's go. That one was up shallow. Really shallow on this uh point that's pretty much right off the main channel too i'm not really that far back in these coves i'm right off the main channel on this flatter rocky point so maybe we'll go off of that that was a really really fun bite guys so glad you guys got to see that one hopefully we can bump in a couple more just like that just like that would be a good one Man, now I'm all jacked up, ready to go. My fingers were frozen. I'm ready to go. Shed some layers and let's do this thing. Woo! Professional work over here, boys. You guys remember that tree right there that's sitting out there? I don't know if you can see that or not, that tree sticking out, but that right there is where I caught that six pound smallie. That exact tree right there. Beginning of the year, I guess that was. Yeah, that was a while ago. Brant, if you're watching this, he went fishing with me that day. I know you remember that tree, buddy. Gosh, it's so calm. Water is so calm. I told you guys, I have a problem talked about this in my last video i literally have like a top water issue seriously i just i just need to stop bringing my top water rig and all my top water baits because if i have a top water tied up next to me i mean compared to pretty much anything else i'm probably gonna grab it oh that was a good start Alright guys, so if you hear somebody talking, I've got Bass Live, or the Bassmaster at Saint Cooper on right now on live, so um, yeah, if you hear somebody talking, it's just them. It's just Zona. Creates cover. 
today. Stay down. Not a big one. Not a big one. Oh, he's barely hooked. One hook. He's got one hook. Okay. Oh, finally, guys. Freaking finally. Look at that. That's a nice largey, too. That is a good fish. Solid, solid fish, guys. Look at that one. Just a healthy, freaking largemouth. Switch back to this Stormarashi Topwalker 2. And uh, solid fish though, nice long. We'll get a, um, a, a length measurement on them. 16 inches, not a big one, but not a small one. We'll take them. It's a keeper bass right there. See you, buddy. Oh, finally. He was shallow. He was shallow for sure. Throwing a jig, throwing a jig. It got really windy outside. Is it too early to throw a spinnerbait? How early is too early? How early is too early to throw a spinnerbait? Oh my gosh, this sums up my, uh, <laughs> this sums up my evening right here, or my day, I guess you could say. <sighs> I mean, freaking choked that thing as soon as it hit the water, but not exactly what we're looking for, folks. <sighs> I'm swinging for the fences, boys. Swinging for the fences on this one. I mean, this thing is just absolutely ginormous. Let me show you what I was throwing. That's the size difference, folks. <laughs> Going for it. You gotta risk it to get the biscuit. That was really stupid of me to say, but am I wrong? About 25 casts later, I did it for a little bit. For a little bit. This is actually, this isn't, this is a sea bait. This is for the sea. It's a funny story about that. I was in, uh, where was I? Maybe just Pensacola? I think I was in Pensacola. Stopped at this awesome little local, local bait shop there. I, that's like my thing to do. I don't know if anybody else is like that, but that's like my thing to do <clears throat> when I'm traveling is uh, go to these different bait shops around just because there's so much different culture. I mean, you would never see anything like that in a bait shop around here. So just cool to see the different stuff, you know. We're going to try a wake bait. Whatever. <sighs> just not able to put anything together. Oh, my good Lord, dude. Are you kidding me? I thought you guys were gone. Hmm? Oh, 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 oh. Good Lord, guy. Ambitious. That's what happens when you fish pissed off. Bad stuff happens. I'm not pissed off at anybody else or anything. I'm just pissed off I freaking don't know how to catch a dang bass. It's like, what the heck, dude? I know this place is loaded right now. There goes Blue Heron. He says, this is my property, boy. What are you doing back here? Ain't no human supposed to be back this far back in the creek. Quick switch, quick switch, quick switch. 
quick switch, switch, switch. Say quick switch four times fast, as fast as you can. I dare you, everybody that's watching this, say quick switch is four times as fast as you can. I challenge you, comment below, let me know how everything went with that.